Today I'm in District 7, a short drive from my home here in Ho Chi Minh City, at the western end of a small but bustling market. Here via a narrow set of alleyways is the modest family home belonging to Wirt and Thuy and their two young children. Natives of Nye An province, some 1500 kilometres north of here, and the birthplace of Ho Chi Minh, Loy and Wirt have been up since 4am. Preparing what's needed for the brekkie dish, I've come here to show you today. Ban Gun. In its simplest form, Ban Gun can be described as a steamed rice crepe, filled with a mixture of wood ear mushrooms, shallots, pepper, garlic and ground pork. Miss Loy tops hers with crispy fried onions and then serves them up with a clutch of lightly blanched bean sprouts, fragrant chopped basil, her own special innovation of pickled papaya and a couple of slices of hearty and rubbery jia lua, a type of pork sausage. Okay, so I'm going to try and explain this dish in a very short time in a very cosy space. Uh, what comes here at Miss Loy's is this. And what makes her pretty special that separates it, apart from tasting great, the thing that separates it from the rest in the area is its freshness. This family here relies on this as their income and they sell a few other odds and ends as well but um, she's come up with this idea to pickle um, papaya, green papaya and um, it just adds that little bit of extra freshness to the dish and then um, all the other stuff that usually comes with it, um, basil, lightly blanched bean sprouts and some jia lua which is a sausage pork and I think there's rice flour in it, a couple of bits of that, um, and onions with the husband here. He spends a day once a week cutting up onions, I've been here before and uh, while he's been cutting them up, so they sell those as well separately, but here it is, that's it there, look at that, looks like a dumpling, doesn't it? Naan, rat naan, and then the sauce and you just dip it in. You can dip it in or pour it on top. Up to you. Mm. So good. It's believed these tasty little rolls of goodness date back a whopping 2,000 years or more, around the time it was discovered that rice could be converted into thin, almost translucent sheets like this. roots in Vietnam hark back to what was once the small village of Tan Chi in the north on the Red River and which is now a district of modern day Hanoi. The back blocks of District 7 are a long way from the home of Ban Gun though which demonstrates just how popular the dish is up and down the country. Not to mention how dedicated people are like Lui and Wit to the preservation of Vietnam's culinary heritage but perhaps also how blindingly enthusiastic they are in giving a clumsy foreigner like me a rare opportunity to cook it for myself. I just hope the growing audience is friendly though. Okay, so Miss Loy, she has a crazy idea. She wants me to learn how to make ban gun. So uh, she's gonna teach me now. I don't know if this is a good idea. Do come. <laughs> uh, I don't know if I can even fit. <laughs> listen, listen to her. Okay, all right. I would, I wouldn't make a very good drummer. Okay, glove. Okay. Do I, do I, do I hum? Do I hum? Mun. Oh. Okay. 
first. <laughs> okay, fail. First, first test just to see if the fingers go in. Okay, all right. All right. Okay, this looks really. De okay, so I feel like I should be drumming. Okay, mop. Okay, all right. I'm left. I'm left-handed by the. Oh shh. Sin lo, sin lo. I've just. I've just lost a percentage of them. Okay. Anyway, I muddle on with the reveal, with Wit returning just in time, as I attempt okay, so to make the Western next? world proud of my efforts and no doubt trigger an entire nation of Vietnamese, well, the two or three watching on, to breathe a collective sigh of relief by elegantly lifting off the canvas the most perfectly intact Deliciously silky flop. At A? At A? At A? Okay. Ah! It's, ah. it's, oh, oh shit, what a mess. Okay, I think I can make Ban Ut. Ban Ut? Ban Ut? This is Ban, ban Ut, the one without the stuffing in it. Okay. Sao đó? Maybe một cái. Một cái hả? Thêm một cái nữa đi. Bỏ cái này xuống. Okay. Một cái nữa. Alright, again. So we go ahead and make an executive decision to give it another go. Okay. Oh, okay. And another. Ah, oh, ah, oh, ah! Oh. And another. Oh, you got it. Until something quite astonishing happens. I peel one off that somehow sticks together. And with the pride of a first time daddy, I do my best not to ruin this beautiful little baby I've just brought into the world. Whoa! <laughs> okay, I'm here. Uh, how do I get it off there though, without ripping it? At out, across, or that way? And then I cut. Okay. Saddle. Saddle, roll over. Oh, this way, this way. Ah, my legs burnt. Ah, the water. <laughs> okay, there's uh, there's my first one. Looks a bit like a looks a bit like a dumpling, doesn't it? Okay. I think there's no chance of selling this. No chance. Todd, huh? Huh? Todd, huh? There we go. Oh, I'm getting burnt. <laughs> Here it is. My ban gun, my ban ut, mat. Yeah, it's actually a lot trickier than it looks. It looks tricky, but it's even trickier to do. There we go. That was a whole bunch of fun. Thanks, Miss Louie, for giving me a go at trying to make those ban gun. I think your job's pretty safe. Now, if you want to come here and check this place out, probably the best thing to do is get on Google Maps and look for Tan We Market and then ask your way around there. In any case, I'll leave some kind of description in the box below so you can find it by yourself. Um, there's a lot of alleyways around here and part of the fun is getting lost and meeting a whole bunch of people. So check it out. Miss Louise Bun Good, let's go to the next place. <laughs>